Sitefinity Cloud is a fully managed platform as a service for enterprise content and experience management. Sitefinity Cloud helps you reduce infrastructure overhead, improve uptime and availability, increase site performance and operational efficiency. In this video, we'll review at a high level the architecture of Sitefinity Cloud and look at the components that make up the infrastructure. In other videos in this series, we'll focus on specific components and learn more about each one. All the Azure services used to provision your Sitefinity Cloud account are contained in an Azure subscription which is owned and managed by Progress. Owning the Azure subscription allows Progress full control over the environment, which ensures proper configuration, setup, and maximum uptime of your websites. Each Sitefinity Cloud customer has its own individual Azure subscription, and no resources are shared between customers. The infrastructure contains both a production and staging environment. Each environment has its own separate instance of Sitefinity with its own database. Additionally, no resources are shared between these two environments. In addition to the underlying infrastructure components, Sitefinity Cloud provides a management portal. The management portal is built on top of Azure DevOps and is the place where you have complete visibility and control over all the processes from development to deployment to production. In the management portal, Progress has provided several pre-configured dashboards for you. These dashboards display information related to the infrastructure, including uptime, CPU usage, available memory, and request execution time. Another key feature of the management portal is the ability to configure and manage the continuous integration and continuous delivery processes. The management portal allows you to configure pipelines and releases to move code between environments. The Sitefinity Cloud Management Portal also provides visibility into the Git Source Control Repository from Azure DevOps. This is where your Sitefinity project source code will live. The management portal also shows code commits pushes, and branches, the features you'd expect with Git source control. Next, let's review the components that make up the Sitefinity Cloud infrastructure. Progress has partnered with Cloudflare to introduce a Content Delivery Network, CDN, as a part of Sitefinity Cloud. Cloudflare caches files and HTML to improve overall site performance. Cloudflare also offers additional benefits such as Web Application Firewall and DDoS prevention. Sitefinity Cloud improves server-side performance by using a distributed output cache. This output cache, powered by Azure Cache for Redis, stores the final HTML that is served to website visitors, reducing database calls and improving site speed. Sitefinity Cloud makes use of Azure App Services to host the Sitefinity application. Azure App Services allows for multiple copies of the Sitefinity application to run at the same time, with the load distributed across the instances. Additionally, the Azure App Service plan is configured to automatically add nodes when the site is under heavier traffic. Sitefinity Cloud has powerful search capabilities, allowing users to easily find content on your site. Sitefinity Cloud uses Azure Cognitive Search to index site content and provide AI-based search capabilities. Sitefinity Cloud uses Azure SQL Database, a scalable, relational database built for the cloud. In addition to the speed and performance Azure SQL Database brings, it also provides easy-to-use management capabilities. Backups are automatically executed once every week, while on-demand backups can be performed via the management portal. And should you ever need to restore data from a previous point in time, Azure SQL Database automatically creates backups every minute of every day and keeps them for 35 days in the past. Backups created through the management portal are stored in Azure Blob Storage and are easily accessible if you need to download a local copy of the database for development purposes. If your database contains personally identifiable information about your customers, the database backup process will obfuscate this data. That way, the copy that you pull down locally will not contain any personal data. As previously mentioned, the Sitefinity Cloud Management Portal is built on top of Azure DevOps. This is the control center of your Sitefinity Cloud, 
and provides everything you need for the entire application lifecycle. For authentication and authorization in Sitefinity Cloud, Azure Active Directory is used. For each Sitefinity Cloud customer, a dedicated Azure Active Directory is created. Sitefinity is then configured to use Azure AD authentication. So whether you're logging in to staging, production, or the management portal itself, you have one single sign-on experience. We'll conclude this introduction with a quick review of the components we've discussed and review the overall Sitefinity Cloud architecture. Cloudflare is used as a CDN and caches site content. Additionally, Cloudflare provides other benefits such as DDoS protection and a web application firewall, which is configured to protect against the OWASP top 10 security risks. Inside Azure, we have a production and staging environment for Sitefinity. Each environment is separate with its own web app and database. Both environments use Azure SQL, Blob Storage, and Azure Search. The production environment uses additional caching and has at least two nodes running at all times. This improves speed and availability of the website. The management portal controls the high-level services such as source control, pipelines, and application monitoring. And Azure Active Directory is used for authentication and authorization. This video is one of a series of videos about Sitefinity Cloud. Make sure to check out the other videos to learn about the many benefits of Sitefinity Cloud.